How you doing guys? This is Greg from SmokeLiberation.com just doing a little instructional video on what to do when you get your first e-cig in the mail. I'm going to be doing this video using the Liberation Mini, or as some of you may know, the DSE 901. Uh, the box looks pretty much like this, and when you open up, you will find your instruction manual. Great little reference. If you have any quick questions, I recommend reading it. And then you're going to see your brand new e-cig along with a spare battery and a little sample pack of five cartridges ranging from high to zero nicotine. Um, I recommend starting with the medium nicotine and kind of going up or down from there and that way you can kind of pace yourself and find what uh, works best for you. I would take that up, put it to the side, and then take your e-cig, put it to the side, and then left in the box you're going to see the two little box right here. And one has the cable for the charger and the other one contains the charger itself. What you want to do with that is go ahead and give your new batteries a good 8 to 12 hour charge. I recommend no less than 8 hours, um, but it, anywhere in between is fun. So I'm just going to go ahead and put this to the side for now and go ahead and demonstrate on what to do on my already charged 901, aka Liberation Mini. What you're going to want to do is put your new cartridge, take it out of the little package it comes in, and you're going to go ahead and put it right into your atomizer. Let me break this down for you really quick. Battery, atomizer, cartridge, just in case you guys are wondering. Go ahead and do that. And uh, go ahead and uh, take a puff. It's pretty good. Alright, now one thing um, a lot of people don't know is you're going to try and uh, different methods of inhaling I find what works best is taking a nice, slow, smooth, long draw off of it. Uh, a lot of people are, I see that are normal smokers of analog cigarettes, they really rip at it the first time and they don't get much vapor and then they're just kind of like, oh, that, that kind of sucks. But what you're going to want to do is uh, the draw makes a huge difference. So what you're going to do is kind of find what works best for you. Um, I can tell you this, it works a little bit different for different atomizer and battery combinations for whatever reason, I don't know. But I found through all of the ones I've used, the best method is a nice, slow, smooth, long draw. So let me go ahead and demonstrate that again. Um, a couple of people on the forums actually put it to a uh, good number, uh, an average of about a five second draw works probably the best. Um, so that's pretty much all you need to know initially. Uh, there are other videos for more advanced methods like how to refill your cartridges, the drip method, um, different kind of things like cleaning out your atomizer if you happen to flood it, and uh, so on and so forth on our channel on YouTube. I think it's the uh, Liberate Yourself channel, I'm pretty sure. Or you can uh, check the videos out on ecigaretteforum.com. Um, I do believe I have a couple videos on there. So that's pretty much it, and I hope you guys have a uh, great little vaping session. Alright, take care.